hey welcome back again for the autocad next tutorial i'm rk and you are watching rk engineering tech so guys today's topic we are going to discuss about dimension because you have seen you have already seen this use of dimension what is dimension dimension is nothing but to modify the properties of some objects like it there is line there is triangle there is arc there is circle there is uh, axis y axis ordinate and there is a different two acts so so guys today's videos will go on a long so guys please don't speak skip this video and continue and take enjoy with this video i will describe one by one all so guys this is our uh there is two four six seven eight uh, there is a, at least at okay and i'm going to discuss all of so video will be some long so please make it uh, first i'm going to use linear dimension linear dimension for the linear dimension face l and enter first you have to draw any line okay i'm going to draw any line and place then press enter and after that take dimension go this and after i'm going to take linear dimensions and make sure this and this and this one thing there is a invisible of text and arrow so i will visible at last otherwise let's click it select and and go to the mo type mo and press enter and you have to show all properties then after that you have to manage this uh, there is 0.1 then manage its point point 8 okay and press enter then after that i have to manage text then go to the text height this is the text and search text height this is the text height and i am also taking 0.8 0.8 and press enter okay and cut then after that see this this is our linear dimension and same as take line command press this this and this okay and after that i'm taking this align dimension align dimension press it this is the align line and this is our dimension am i right and i'm again i'm going to take angular dimension so take first first line first line and take second line and this our dimension am i right and i'm going to arc dimension so i'm going to press arc and press enter to create arc and place this is the specify first point this is the second point and make one of the arc okay then after that i'm going to take arc dimension this this is the arc length so press this select an arc any object and after that specify this our arc dimension otherwise you can choose you can take it uh, specify this and sorry take this and select select object this here is the arc dimension okay and after that i'm going to take circle c command and press any radius because you have to dim you have to measure this radius and go to this and after that take this radius measurement and select circle circle and after that this and this this is our radius am i right then after that i'm going to take ordinates so take line command press here press and press and press enter sorry
okay this is our ordinates let's take ordinate dimension this and let's assume here our ordinates at this point let's assume and click on that and go to this okay again press enter and click on that and go to this so this is our dimension okay and next one i'm going to several arcs this is our several arcs so i'm going to use uh, arc command and i'm going to make out this arc okay and press enter and again i'm going to use our command and press first point here and second point here second point and sorry outward sorry <laughs> this going inward and first delete it and again use our command and after that select first point here and next point anywhere so this is our command so it's and after that i'm taking this dimension so last dimension so which i have this jog dimension so i'm taking this select object and specify center and that's our radius again press enter select object and specify and this sorry select this dimension jog dimension and after that select this object and specify center and you can arrange anywhere okay and now i'm going to visible all dimensions so select all dimensions select all dimension select uh, all dimension and i'm taking this this crossing window for selected okay let's remove it first select all and after that type mo for the properties and go to this a zero point eight and go for the height text height which is our text height this and zero point eight point eight press enter and then got this and in such a way you have you are going to use this dimension command so guys I hope you have understood that. Thank you so much.